Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night, depending on what time you're watching this next episode from me, Avamance, and today we are on the Avamancia Peninsula. We have got episode 29, I think this is, of Avamancia. Thank you for joining me. We are starting in a place we don't normally start. We're starting at the mate's base. The reason we're starting at the mate's base is because I want to be doing everything kind of on the peninsula a bit, and I didn't want to have to come back here. This is going to be a cheeky, quick one. Brilliant, and now it's raining. This is going to be a cheeky, quick one. Um, because I'm going on holiday and as a result I've not got loads of time to make a massive massive long video but I'm going to make you a video because that's what I like to do so we're going to get ourselves in to the mate's base so I've got rotten flesh because I've just had to bash a few zombies but we're going to get one of our signs we're going to come along here and which is where we're we going to put it we're going to put it here this is going to be our episode 29 slot so episode 29 and today's lucky winner is P-A-N-C-U-A. Pancua or Pancua. Katie, I don't know how you say that word. Tell me phonetically in the, in the uh, comments below. Is it Pancua? I don't care. It's a nice name and you are welcome in this ever decreasing exclusive area that is the mate space. Look, we've only got three spots left and then I'm going to have to put another level or something on it or an expand it or something. There's an episode if ever I saw one. So there we go. Episode 29, mate space member. Thank you, Ed. Thank you very much for all the support you have given me over the last ages. It's an absolute pleasure to have you in here and uh, hopefully uh, you will be uh, one of these exclusive members for a very long time. Let's crack on with the episode. It's not going to be a long one, but we've got to get on with it. So I'm back over on the island. You can see we are next to where all these animals are. And if you saw the last episode, you'd uh, remember that I mentioned about the chickens that are latched on to the end of my house. Now that's only a temporary house. It's not going to be my real house. But I want to get rid of them. I want to get them off the end of my house because they keep me awake at night. Oh yes, they do. So what we're going to do is we're not going to build a chicken cooker we're going to build a chicken coop. And the difference between a chicken co a cooker and a chicken coop is a chicken coop is basically an egg farm. So we're going to create an egg farm and we're going to create it here in this space here. And it's going to be, I think, a relatively simple one. So what we've got to do first is make it so as I can actually see what I'm doing. And I'm going to I've put a load of stuff in here. You can see I've got a load of bits and pieces in here. So first off, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some spruce do i want spruce wood yeah i'm gonna get some no no i'm gonna get some cobble and then i'm gonna get these rails and that is a decent start i think so i'm gonna build a four by four platform here and how far out do i want to come in so i want to come in one two and then a four by four platform here there we go one two three four one two three four one two three four and one, two, three, and four. Now I think I'm gonna to have to get rid of this one now. So let's uh, get rid of these trappies because I can put a light on this to keep the light going. That's not a problem. Come around here and then get my gentle pickaxe and my mega pick to get rid of those. Okay, so we've got that sorted. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna fill this in because we're gonna because I've now got to think about what I'm going to do here. Uh, oh, first off, I've got to get rid of that. So I've got in here, I think, yeah, I've got four blokes. I've got so much redstone, I can just use this. It's dead easy. So I've got four blocks of redstone, which I'm going to put in. No, not there. There, there, and there, I reckon. Yeah, let's put them there. And then we're going to come up. Can you tell? I'm making this bit up as I go along. And that's because I can. And we're going to stick that there, that there, that there, and that there. So now what we've got to do is we've got to try and fill out um, all of this 16, which is why I've got eight rail, eight of each type of rail. All of these 16 area as um, a looped you can call it a, a looped minecart area and I don't think I've done it right have I it's got to be another row which means I've not got enough rails I have to go and get some more rails there we go we're going to do it that size uh, I'm going to have to go and get some more redstone as well right I'm going to go and do that I'll be back in a minute 
So I managed to get the full map right. So we've got it one, two, three, four, five, six along that way, and one, two, three, four, five along that way. And a lot of noisy people over there. Thank you very much. So this is this is basically the the floor, if you like. This is the floor of the whole doodah. And what we're going to do is we're going to get two chests and two trap chests. So the two chests are going to go there and there, and then the two trap chests are going to go there and their recipe for trap chests is on the screen now if you don't know how to make a trap chest okay dead easy that one isn't it look there you go and then what we're going to do is in here we're going to shove two hoppers one going into each now what you've got to remember is eggs stack into 16 and not into 64 so i've got two full double chests here because they're going to fill up really really quite easily and I've got two left rails that are going to go onto here, one on there, and one on there. So now what happened is I'm going to put a minecart with hopper on here. It's going to run around and around and around like that. And when it goes over the hoppers, it's going to shove any eggs that is picked up into these two chests. Dead easy, right? So that's the idea of the collection system. Then. I need to collect some more stuff here. We're going to get some oak wood and we're going to build up the legs because like any old house, you need to have um, plenty of uh, oakage on your house. You know, I do love my oak stuff. So we're going to come out one from the corner. So this is the corner and then one. We're going to come up one, one there. Same this way. One there. Same this way. One there and one there so that's going to be basically the side it's quite big isn't it it's going to be somebody that's really big one two three do i want it any bigger than that out i think that's probably enough so we're going to go four high one two three all the way along up one two three and down here as well one two and three that's great so now what we're going to do is we're going to make it a little more I guess you say call it pretty. So let's get ourselves some nice wood. What sh let's go for oak wood for this one. So we're going to trim this off in oak wood. All the oh, I can hear some it. Where are you? Where have you come from? Go away. Go away. There you go. That's what you get. Right. So we're going to come around all the way around this way and trim this all off. Where are you coming from? Go away. Are you two go and tell your mates. That we're not interested. Don't no door-to-door -door sales here, thank you very much. So we're coming all the way around here with this trim like that. So that is basically the outside of that um, outside of the chicken coop. And then we're going to build another level all the way around. Like this. And I wonder whether or not this actually isn't going to be high enough. Hmm. Then I need some glass blocks. Glass blocks. I've not got any glass blocks. Right, I'll come back and get some glass blocks in a minute. Have I got any sand? Have I got any sand? No. I'm going to go and get some sand from down here because I only want a couple of... Oh, there's an enderman. Go away. And a creeper, of course, we don't... Yeah, he blew up part of my base. Right, so I'm going to have to fix that. But it did mean that I got some... Right, where's the Enderman gone? Right, so I'm fighting an Enderman and a Creeper at the same time. And I didn't get a drop. Is that because the Creeper killed him? Stop making such a silly noise, for goodness sake, you big baby. Right, I think that's enough sand for now that I can make some more. I'm going to have to come and fix those. That's going to bother me, obviously. So I'm going to come along here. I'm going to shove the sand in there. And that will make me some glass blocks. And whilst that's doing that, I can trim this off. What we got there? Uh, I've got 65. I don't manage to get 65. Okay, so we'll get rid of that one first. No, not that. Oh, for goodness sake. Get rid of that. And that can go there. And then the other 64 can come in there and there. All the way around. Might have to re how's that light it might be all right i might leave it there for now coming all the way around like that and 
No, like that. Right, so I do need to eat some food because I've just realised I've lost four hearts. How that happen? Right, so let's take that glass and we're going to put that glass here, there and there because that then allows us to keep the openability of those two chests. Okay, so next, this level here is basically, that's just one block, so that's taken up by these um, rails. So what we need to do is we need to have another row of blocks but I wonder whether or not I might do this with cobble just to change it up a little bit it's going to be quite high this uh, this chicken coop isn't it I've just realized it's come along this way and I need to get some grass because I actually want grass in the chicken coop and not um, not dirt so what I'm going to do is I'm going to come along here I'm just going to get a few blocks of grass which I can get from here this is my silk touch pickaxe so what that will give me is grass. You get actual grass blocks rather than um, rather than dirt when you use a silk touch pickaxe to collect stuff like this. So I'm just going to grab a bit of glass. A uh, bit of glass, a bit of grass, I reckon. Who's firing at me now? Seriously, you want a piece as well? There you go. Don't mess about. That's not what anybody wants. I can see your head poking up over there. I don't know what you're thinking you're doing. Oh no. Are you still dying? You go away as well. Have you got any gunpowder for me? No, you do not. Right, so get back on point, Abamance. You are getting distracted. This is only supposed to have been a little episode, for goodness sake. Get yourself all sorted here. Right, come on. Up we go. Up we go. Up, up, up. And then, where's... Here we go. Up. And up and up and up again. Sound like Coldplay again, don't I? So we've then got ourselves nine grass blocks. And I need to get myself up here. This is not what I had in mind, you know. This has not quite worked out the way I wanted it to. So I'm going to get rid of that. I'm going to put that like that. I'm going to change that for that. And we're going to stick that on there. And that on there like that. Because, you know, I quite like this. Mm. I think I need to remove that. Have I got any spruce blocks? I have, haven't I? Yeah, I do. Right, so let's get some spruce block. And we can take that fella out and shove that fella in. That's much better. Much, much nicer looking is that now. Right, so that is going to have to come out. At least for the time being. We're going to get that out like that. Spruce wood. That like that, that like that. And then the same on this other side. In the middle, we're going to chop that fella out. We're going to get that there. This is going to overlap on there, which is not what I wanted. But we are going to put that like that. You know what? So I need that all to match, otherwise it's going to bug me. Let's lose that. And let's lose that. Which will then allow me, at least for the time being again, to replace that there. And there! Okay. We're getting there, and then it doesn't offend me too much that being like that. Uh, yeah, we're good. Right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to come up here, and we can get up the top of here. And we're going to get our dirt and some grass, and I'm going to put dirt along each side here. And that means, have I, I've not got enough, have I? One, two, three, four, five. I need five by one, two, five by four. I need 20 grass. 20, for goodness sake, man. Get yourself some more. You know you want to. We keep getting this. Hello, Mr. Chicken. You could come and live in my house in a minute if you want. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Except it won't be you, but it could be your children. There we go, 20. So now we can come along and we can come up here. We can come up here. Right, so now I'm just going to put grass like that. What I am also going to do is just realize I've not got my. Oh, for goodness sake. Right, so this is going to annoy me. I've got to pick that up. I've got to get a wooden block, shove the wooden block in there. 
so as I can get up. I need to go and get myself my hopper minecart because I realize I've not picked it out. Let's come up back up this way. This is appalling, mate. What are you doing, for goodness sake? Then you need to axe this fella away and you need to get your rail again. Shove your rail back on there and you need to get your hopper minecart and shove your hopper minecart on there and somehow make that go. Yep, that's what's going to happen. So what we've got to do now is we've got to find ourselves a little exit. What is it that I say about failing to plan B and planning to fail? Well, this is an example of that. So let's push that. That fella's going now. We can then put that like that. This is just an abomination. Right, so we come in that like that and that like that. There we go. Right, that's how it's going to work. So we can shove these grass in here. And what happen is these dirts will then get soaked up um, by the grass as the grass grows across. It's already done it once there already. And then we're going to get... These are going to come up another two. One and two. One and two. One and two. Then I'm going to get more cobble. Because I'm going to put some cobble in the corners as well. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to shove cobble in the corners up to the height of the post and then the rest of it's going to be glass um, glass panes specifically so I've got to go and get some more cobble and our cobble I actually have haven't I? I'm going to go and get some more cobble and I'll be back when I've built up a little bit more so we've done quite a lot actually we've done a nice kind of textured area around these windows and we can come up and we can look inside and we can see what's going on inside if we want to and what I now want to do I put myself a little ladder up this side here so as we can get in and out we've got a good view window to watch that fella going round and round which is wonderful and then we're going to come up here to the top here and then we've got I've got five glowstones in my hand, but what I actually want to do is use just four of them. And I'm going to put one there, one there, one there, and one there. I know those two are slightly offset, but it really doesn't matter, honest. And then what we'll do then on top is we'll get these fellas and fill in the gaps. All the way around like that and then I've got to go back down because I've forgotten the most important part God, it's, you ever had one of those days where you know you sort of wish you were in um, dusty depot when the meteor hit off of Fortnite. that's the sort of day I'm having at the minute so let's get some eggs going and what I'm gonna do I'm just basically gonna throw eggs in here until I get some hatches there you go so we've got some really quite lousy spawn rate right there with the chickens but such is that's all right that doesn't matter and we're just going to get a few chickens in here another 16 eggs okay and one more okay so we got a few chickens in there and all we need to do is wait for those little fellas to grow and once they've grown we can do some more fun with them so we've had a few little breeding cycles. I've had to take this corner out because I couldn't reach. And uh, what we've got in here is quite a number of chickens. I've fed them quite a lot of corn, so we bred up quite well. So what I'm now gonna do, I love it when they do that. I love it when they just all crowd round. There we go. So can I find any that are ready to breed with me? Yeah, there they are. Let's get some breeding going. Awesome, that's quite fun. Right, so. That are, I think, probably enough chickens in there now. We don't need to overcrowd it. We're not trying to completely overload everything. What we are trying to do is simply give ourselves a, uh, a decent number of chickens. Not every egg, you can see, is going to be captured. If they fall on the edge, because eggs don't take up a whole block, if they fall on the edge of these here, they're not going to go and we'll lose them. But if they're, you see that one in the middle there? If they're hatched, kind of, or given birth to, What's, what'd, you, what'd you do? You lay. You lay an egg, for goodness sake, man. Um, if you lay an egg in the middle of the grassy bit, happy days, you're going to end up with some nice eggage in your um, in your chest. So now what I need to do is I need to refill, oh, except I've not got my stone. Right, let's go back and get more stone. 
I'm all over the place today, ain't I? Right, so let's get a couple of those. That'll do. That'll do. I'm happy with that. That's all I need. Up we go. Okay, so shove that there, there, and there. And then I can pop those in like that, that, and that. And then all I need to do is to make the roof. And I'm just going to do a relatively flat roof. We're not going to mess about with all kinds of different pitches. I'm almost certainly going to need to come back down and get more. I know. Come around, 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 like this. There we go. So we've got, I want to leave this bit open. Um, if I, I show you what I mean. So let's just get that bit back. Um, I want to leave kind of a, like a ledge. Because what that will do is that will allow nothing to spawn in there whatsoever but you'll be able to see the glowstone from uh, the side which I quite like because what we are going to do is we're going to use some more glass blocks which I almost certainly haven't got but hopefully those ones that I put in um, to the fiery furnace a little bit earlier on will be ready so like that and I'm going to come down we're going to come into the furnace how many glass blocks we got got 21 glass blocks which we both know you and I, dear viewer, are not going to be enough for what we want to achieve. So, have I got... You know what I'm going to... This is up and down. This is my ladder practice. What we're going to do is we're just going to make some more um, slabs. I'm going to do another layer of slabs. Like another, th another thing of slabs all the way around here like this. As a circuit. There and there. There, 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 and there. And then what I can do is I can get my... No, not that. Right, that'll be collector when it falls in. I can get my glass like that. And like that. That looks all right. And then I can come down here and fall a lot and collect up. Well, I didn't do that too well either, did I? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just going to tear up this way. I'm going to get my like that. Get myself a nice. Let's see if I know shift clip across this way. Spruce wood stairs upside down like that, and we're away. Then I just get my gentle pickaxe with silk touch on it, and that gives me my glass black. I think that looks all right. And then if we want to see what's going on, we can just. See the chickens in there. We can get the chickens up and around this side. They come up there. Look, we can see the chickens. Say, hello, Mr. Chicken. Go and lay some eggs. And then already, I imagine, we've got some eggs starting to accumulate in these chests. Look, so there's the spruce wood thing that I wanted. There's a chest there. That's got 10 in that side. We are laughing. Actually, that is a good job. I'm just going to shove a load of stuff back in here now. And that way, that won't get lost for next time I need to use them. Shove that in there and that in there. I got one eye of Ender from shooting one thing a little earlier on. And we are laughing. And there you have it. We have got one chicken coop egg farm, if you want. You can call it an egg farm. I think officially it is an egg farm. And that is going to produce eggs loads. All oh, I've missed a I've missed a, um, a ladder there. I need to sort that out. I need to go and get that in a minute. But if you've enjoyed that, I think it's, it's quite a nice little quick easy build I think and if you've enjoyed it please do remember to slap the like button it'd be great to know you're enjoying this Avermancia series and I will continue to make it also if you've not done it already please do remember to hit that subscribe button it'd be great to see you in my sub club and the notification squad slap that bell and I look forward to seeing you in another video you take it easy now bye